you want to be this okay? Sure. I'll be. I'll be Renvier. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid rank of Corbin. I'm Shah Rukh Khan. But he would do that just out of respect. Of course. Shah Rukh Khan. Absolutely. He just feels he needs to do that to respect Shah Rukh Khan. Of course. Who wouldn't? Of course. I was, that's what I was going to say. Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? <laughs> Today, we got a village cooking channel because oh. I'm excited. And this is 1000 Idli with mutton. Did I say that? Kulambu. Kulambu. All you have to say is mutton. You, you know, had me at mutton. I know Idli's. I mean, we had yes. Idli's. I made Idli's, actually. You did make Idli's. Uh, they're, they're quite... They're good. Um, obviously, they require good chutney. Um, but we did have Idli's, which is the delicious South Indian breakfast in Delhi. Because that's where, of course, you should have it. You should. It's like getting... It's like getting Domino's pizza in Italy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> granted, it's probably better than getting Italy's in Los Angeles. Yeah. It's still in India. I, it, it's in India. At least it's close enough. And they it's probably made by a South About Indian. I would South, yeah, I would think so. I had I got ridiculed twice because my first exposure to South Indian food was in Kolkata. Kolkata. <laughs> Idiot. Yep. Here we go. Yell at me! Yeah. Ah, ah, hey. Welcome to you! You have to soak stuff for so long. It's so time consuming. Yeah. How long does rice. How long is that gonna have to soak? Uh, five to ten hours. Good grief. That's how long we, I had to soak the, the whatever it was for the Italy's. I forget what they're called. So time consuming. I hate roosters. I hate roosters. You're weird, man. You like them? Yeah. There's nothing wrong with roosters. You had to soak this, too. You've never lived around a rooster, then. Have you lived around a rooster? And you like it. Yeah. You're a weirdo. <laughs> oh, I love that. I want to go in wherever they were standing outside of. Oh, nice stone. It's a toilet. No. <laughs> gonna gonna grind wow, it up. That was satisfying. Kind of looks like grits almost. By hand, man. Holy cow. I put ours in a blender. <laughs> to make a paste? That's gonna take hours. That's unbelievable. <laughs> what a cutie. She's looking like, what's going on? Oh. 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 So wow. cute. She is gorgeous. All those sounds. Cow. Look at that. Must have taken them hours. Well, the sun's gone down. And I think it needs to ferment, from what I, if I recall correctly. Unreal. And this must have taken them a long I really, time. Yeah, I would have loved to have seen the time lapse on that. It took us a long time. Well, it's night now. First time we've ever seen this in a video where they've been cooking by the firelight at night. 
நாங்கள் எல்லா மாவும் ஆட்டுக்களில் போட்டு ஆட்டி எடுக்கலாம் ஏன்னா நாங்கள் பாதி ஆட்டி கட்டிருக்கும் போதே மழை வந்துடுச்சு அதனால் எங்களால் தொடர்ந்து அரைக்க முடியல அதனால் கிரைண்டரில் போட்டு தான் ஆட்டி எடுத்தோம் அதுவுமே கரண்ட் போயிட்டு போயிட்டு வந்ததுனால அரைச்சிருக்கு ரொம்ப சிரமமாக போச்சு ஒரு வழியை இப்போ அரைச்சி எடுத்தாச்சு இப்போ கிட்ட மணி பதினொன்று மழை நிறைய பிரிஞ்சுக்கிட்டு இருக்கு இப்போ கிட்ட உப்பை போட்டு பிணைஞ்சி வச்சுட்டு அப்படின்னா காலையில் புளிச்சிடும் நாளைக்கு எழுதி இட்லி அவிச்சிடலாம் அரிசி மாவு Yep. Look how much that is, man. Hello, bit. They're going to have to let it sit for a, like overnight. That is so freaking satisfying. I want to know what that feels like. Yep. Let it sit overnight. The amount of crickets there was amazing. a big idli maker <laughs> goat <laughs> is that the mutton <laughs> video i want to know how long it took to uh, yeah this, this whole long process. one probably a few days i bet oh the crackle of the fire Saying Italy, only we had in South India, not in Delhi. <laughs> the basil? that went into that. Oh, it might have been. <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me if it was. <laughs> it might have been that goat. <laughs> <laughs> what a cutie. What are they? 
Love the guitar. This, this, some Thanksgiving dinners don't require this much time and effort. Right on top of the Italy, huh? We didn't eat it like that. No. It was alone. That's because we were in Delhi. Yeah. Delhi. Am I right, guys? Sounds like it's raining out there. I wish we would get that kind of rain here, man. Yeah. their videos so much i do too i would love to know how long it actually took them because i feel like this one took days at least two full days because it, it, with the soaking yeah and the fermenting and then just obviously the preparing man that that's got to take so long yeah because i remember when we did it i was just exhausted with the video I was like, i'm <laughs> i'm so done <laughs> it was delicious um and I, I was glad we made it, but man, it took so long. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm really sad. Like, uh, there's no way I could do my cooking channel right now. I just, oh, I, I've stars, no. I, one, I can't control Leland long enough because he's a toddler. And so mm -hmm. he, when he was doing the video, he was at a certain age where he's just like happy to be mom and dad. Right. And now he's just, just sit there everywhere. And yeah. I don't want to be here. <laughs> <laughs> and then obviously we have two twins who. Need our attention every five seconds. You could just get two dangly swings for the twins that are just going like this, and then you could harness your son uh, onto the table, just like strap him down, <laughs> cook on him, <laughs> just strap him there, and make his tummy be the place where you actually yeah. prepare the dishes. Yeah, he'd love it. I want Indian food. Yeah. When was the last time you had Indian food? Last night for dinner. When did you have? <laughs> she made a. a a grilled smoked garlic eggplant kind of she makes eggplant stuff a lot huh yeah it's one of our favorite go-to's that and okra and uh then just doll we didn't have doll last night we just had this okra i mean this eggplant that she 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 cooks over an open fire with garlic cloves stuck in them and then peels the skin off and mashes it up with onion and uh, cilantro and and tomato and has been nice having it. homemade Indian food just being made for you. Since yes, you it really is. <laughs> it really is. And then, and then we used because she doesn't make it. We just use tortillas to. It's so close. Oh, she doesn't do the rotis. She do the rotis, but get, do something close to that. And then she she claims that I she's ready to show you what she thinks about my chai or cha in Bengal. 
She's like, I can't wait for us to go back and you make chaw for my family. It's a lot of pressure. Yeah. She's like, they're going to be so impressed that a white American guy makes chai that good. Thank you, Vicky. That's going to be a, that's a lot of pressure. A lot of pressure. I'm going to be standing in there, her mom and her brother and sister. Are, we, are you kidding me? Them judging how you're doing it. Yeah. <laughs> I know they'll be kind, but <laughs> she, she's bragging on my, my chai. But yeah, we going to eat it again. Going to eat it. We had enough to have again tonight. And it's gonna be nice to just have uh, homemade Indian. Food. You should you should see that. I, you talk about. I remember one night she had. I always give her more rice than me, even though she's only five feet tall. She eats more rice than I do. So she had this huge plate of rice and dal. And I ha- took a phone call, two minutes, hung up, started to eat, and looked. Her plate was clean. I said, "You realize?" I looked at my call. I said, "You ate." All of that rice and dal in two minutes. And she's like, mm-hmm. You know, you can go to the Indian store and they have already made um, rotis that you can buy. Either fresh or they also have frozen ones as well. Well, now our problem is where we live now. There really isn't. Is we, there have not, to, we have to time it. Is there not, time it like when I come to film. Is there not an Indian uh, grocery around you? No. Not close enough. I feel like there's one on Ventura. Down by you. No. Not that I've seen. The closest one is the are the two that are over on this this part of town, Bombay and India Sweets. And anyways, let us know what other videos we can react to, uh, and what Rick should have for dinner. Let him know. Yeah. <laughs>